listeners and subscribers. Hope all is well. Just going to do a quick hit right here, and uh, I'm going to put a link in, uh, link in the description below. But I thought this was very interesting, uh, and I wanted to share it with you guys. So, teachers shot with pellets during active shooter drills, Teacher Association says. So, let's read this, right? Several Indiana school teachers were shot with projectiles execution style during a recent active shooter drill, leaving welts, drawing blood, and frightening the educators, the Indiana State Teachers Association said. Teachers were terrified, but were told not to tell anyone what happened. Teachers waiting outside that heard the screaming were brought into the room four at a time and the shooting process was repeated uh, the association said on twitter no one in education takes these drills lightly the risk of harming someone far outweighs whatever added realism one is trying to convey here ista executive director dan holub told cnn the incident took place in january at metal lawn elementary in monticello which is part of the Twin Lakes District. The drill is part of ALICE training, which helps prepare schools or other organizations for an active shooter event. During active shooter drill, four teachers at a time were taken into a room, told to crouch down, and were shot execution style with some sort of projectiles, resulting in injuries to the extent that wells appeared and blood was drawn. The White County Sheriff's Department did not respond to CNN's request for comment. White County Sheriff Bill Brooks told the Indy Star that the ALICE training used an airsoft gun but the department stopped doing so after a teacher was upset by it. Holub said the ISTA has not heard an explanation from law enforcement as to why this method was used. This was the first time, and hopefully the last time, that law enforcement shoot at teachers as part of the training, Holub said. Those teachers who went through it were upset and injured. They brought it to the attention of ISTA leadership. The Twin Lakes School Corporation said in a statement that school staff works with the White County Sheriff's Department to conduct ALICE training. The Twin, the Twin Lakes Classroom Teachers Organization recently voiced questions regarding how the Sheriff's Department conducted the training, the corporation said, and Twin Lakes then facilitated a meeting between them to discuss the issue. I mean, you know, you know it's like no wonder some people um, are concerned about, you know, drills going live and some of the inconsistencies around um, that issue. But uh, we, we're not going to go there right now. The Teachers Association told the startling story on Twitter on Wednesday as a part of its recommendations to amend House Bill 1004 concerning school safety. The proposed bill, which has passed the House, requires an annual active shooter drill and provides Indiana school uh, access to funds for mental health services. Rep. Wendy McNamara, a Republican legislator who authored HB 1004, told CNN that a mock shooting like the one that happened in January was not wise and shouldn't happen again. I would never have thought in a million years that anybody would have thought it made sense to use an inactive shooter drill where teachers are unaware that they're going to be shot with a pellet gun, she said. That would never have crossed my mind as something we'd need to legislate. Well, of course not, because you guys don't think this stuff through, and this is the kind of stuff that happens when, I mean, the people end up getting the short end of the stick when we see these types of legislations, policies, and reforms after, you know, tragedies, right? Organic or otherwise. The bill has already passed the House, so Mick Namara said she hopes the Senate can amend the bill to address the issue. The bill calls for active shooter training, but I want to make sure it's clear that being part of an active shooter drill, we do need we do not need to be that realistic and shooting pellets at our teachers, she added. Again, I'm going to say it's no wonder what people have concerns about drills going live and these types of situations um, with inconsistencies around uh, some of these stuff that end up uh, some of these things that uh, end up making headlines. Right. But I, I thought that was interesting. Go ahead and share it. If you if you get the undertones of of the implications of this article, go ahead and, you know, leave a comment below. All right. California Carter signing off.